What's going on guys? This is Chase fan number nine here and I'm coming at you with another diecast review. And in this video I'm gonna be taking a look at Chase Elliott's 2017 number 24 Mountain Dew Chevrolet SS. Um this paint scheme was ran in the um sprint um I mean not the sprint show in the um all-star race that year. He also um he was also in the um Monster Energy Open, that um, 50 lap um, dual race, but he won it and he made it in, I believe. I could be wrong, but yeah. And um, he transferred into the All-Star Race and I think he got a good finish that night, I believe, yeah. And that is that. Um, this paint scheme actually looks really nice. Um, been cool if he ran it in a points paying race but i'm fine with him running it in the all-star race which is fine um, this is the same all-star race that um kyle bush won so yeah um i mean i do like um the mountain dew paint scheme that he's running now including the baja blast one but um this one was actually a good one back in the day so yeah just with the green and the white so yeah but anyways and that's pretty much all i have to say so without further ado um let's get into the video shall we so on the hood here you got um mountain dew you got um 24 here on the front along with the hendrick motorsports logo there in small print and i shouldn't have to say what type of car it is because it's pretty obvious Got nice green decal, by the way, here on the front. And you got some here on the side where the contingency sponsors are at. You got Chase's name there, build the driver's side window. And you got, I think that's an 88 logo there, that little, um, that little, um, American flag looking number there. You got several contingency sponsors. You got 24, Mountain Dew, Kelly Blue Book, Valvoline, Sun Energy One, and Napa. I also love the green here on the bottom. That looks pretty nice. So, yeah. You got um, 24 here on the on the top. You got Mountain Dew on both the top and on the back. Clean Napa Auto Parts on the trunk and Elliot's last name there on the um, back windshield. Yeah, for some reason I keep these cars in their box, but they come out dusty. I don't know why, but it's just me. But anyways, guys, um, that'll do it for this diecast review. On thank you guys for watching. This has been Chase Fan Number Nine here. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Make sure to hit the bell down below to get notifications for all my videos. Make sure to hit that like button and go follow me on Twitter at ChaseFan underscore 9. And with that, I'll see you guys on my next video. And until then, have a good one. Bye, everyone.